So I was a very young child, around five, with way too much energy around the house. And I think it was actually my grandmother that said to my mother, you should really put her into some dance classes. You know, just exert that energy somewhere else. And by the time I was seven, I bought a pair of point shoes and that was kind of it. I've been in the studio every day of my life. I was invited to be introduced to this beautiful place called BAM Center. Through my, my time as a dancer with Ballet BC, we came here and did a few residencies. And it was extraordinary. The first time I saw this center and just what it meant and what it was about and what it invited us as artists to be able to explore was, yeah, it's extraordinary. It's a remarkable creation that this institution exists, not just in Canada, but around the world. BAM Center is located in this incredible kind of center point of beauty, of nature, of energy. The sense of being just kind of lands. You hear things, you see things differently, the smell, the air, the land. It just wakes up the senses. It's a grounding that then opens up these, this not just a vista, but a vista inside yourself. I think it really invites listening. With the speed of our world and the context of a more urban reality that most of us live in, this is going to be needed even more than it was because it's that much more distant from a lot of our realities. A lot of us are in a very high speed, overly produced environment. This is exactly what we need in order to be able to be understanding who we are as artists. We need to express ourselves and we need a place to be able to understand how to create meaning in the world and, and to do that through art and to make sure that that doesn't get erased. BAM Center makes it not only possible, it says it matters and it says we're gonna help you go deeper.